guys welcome back to one of my next cooking videos and today I will be cooking um, her goat pasta and it's my very first time doing so so we're going to get this going so far the arm um, here I have the mutton it's already seasoned guys right for like a week now yes because I um when me just buy me meat them as I come home with them from the supermarket I season them right there and then opposed to make them get all frozen and then have to season them over and I think it's time um I think it saves time by doing so that you have all your meat seasoned already so you just cook out and we not have to tell you can just put to cook because we need not have to tell you how to cook well enough of that so this was already seasoned and I use um, a bit of my special seasoning you can go ahead and make your special seasoning and uh, a bit of um, maggi chicken and all purpose a little black pepper and a little salt with the curry so now that is that and pasta here don't worry about the tomatoes it's not going in the pasta it's um for my salad and these are for the curry goats okay you know we have to cook that first and then we make our curry goat pasta so over here pressure cook already yeah the oil has been eaten over here so now i will add garlic I'm not sure if you can see it here. Right. Have that burn out. Yeah. You know, as the meat and tradition are around the area, burn your curry with your garlic. A bit. You guys I really don't have to do that. But tradition because curry now for burn out. Once you have you cook it to play our time. You will be fine. So, I didn't need to Alright, so now I'm going to let this um stay for like a next two minutes or so then I add some water and allow it to push for like half an hour okay. and then I'll check to see if it's ready because it depends on this the tenderness of the goat right so that is that so guys finish pressuring I'm going to add that Finish season of this spot by adding some peppers, some scotch on it, onion, celery, and thyme, a of ginger, and then add the, um, the pasta for to that. Um, we're not going to cook it for full term because we don't want it to be soft and soggy in the pasta. Right, and this is the part for the finishing job. Never mind the corn, they are not going in the pasta. I just need to eat separately. So we can go and prepare this pot. Okay guys, so let's make our full goat pasta. So first the pot already is that I'm going to add the butter. Yes. 
Let's add a bit of beef pepper and onion. So I say beef a bit. This is good for flavor. Eh? Good way to put the um the whole wood and the pasta. I always use other extra. Right, I'm going to add the pasta. And guys, this is my way. You can always do it here in the UK. And it's okay. Do it my way. Because we are all here to learn and share new ideas. Okay, I'm going to add some milk. <laughs> so people here the core goes that I will be adding to the past over there and this is my um, vegetable my little salad that I am making. Yes, vegetables are a must have for me. I will soon let you know what's in my Today. So, I didn't in stages. I'm not going to have all of this at once. So, I'm going to have a lot. Whoa, it's looking perfect already. This smells so good. Still have a little creamy look. So, we will have it coming out here. Here. Okay. So, presentation time for our horrible pasta. Presentation time. Yes. Guys, it smells so good. So, you can always try this with me at home, you know. Don't want to go out, especially in these times to mix and mingle. You can find new and ideas to create your perfect little meal at home. Guys, I appreciate you all for staying tuned to this channel, liking, sharing, subscribing. Yes, let's mix this beauty together. I had already sprinkled a little sugar on it, a little granulated sugar. So, to go ahead and share the food, the presentation, show you all here how oh, we pulled through on this meal today. Yes, guys, we did it. Not me, we. Okay, lovely people, here is the finished product. Right? So, here is our curry wood pasta. And I hope you guys, you guys enjoyed enjoy watching this video and thank you for all the likes and love the share the support that you have been giving this channel the past year yes guys oh i didn't tell you what was in the salad it consists of um tomatoes lettuce spinach cucumber um dried cranberries and um carrots yes vegetables are a must have for me let me taste this wow People, you're not even going on. Y'all need to try this. Y'all need to try this recipe at home. Yes. Yes, guys. Y'all need to try this recipe at home. Okay. And for those who haven't watched, if you are new to this channel, I have a lot more videos um, uploaded that you can watch. I recently uploaded a healthy smoothie video. Go ahead and watch it. I'm going to. Yeah, I'm going to, I think I'm going to insert it in this clip, yes. So go ahead and watch that and watch the others for ideas and recipes that y'all can try. 
thank you again. I'm going to add this delicious meal now. Thank you.